a quick look at how you can receive 23 centimeter signals with an Android mobile phone. You need a RTL SDR. It needs to be the genuine version. Others are not so stable. This is the version four. You need a suitable antenna. This is a bi-quad, which has a little bit of gain, a bit more if you put a reflector behind it. Very easy to make. And as you can see, it's just some wire soldered onto the back of a SMA socket. Then you need a suitable cable that goes from the USB on the RTL into the phone. And then finally, your Android smartphone with suitable software. I've covered all these in other videos, which I'll link in the video description. But I thought I'd do a quick video just to demonstrate that you can do it. It's a lot lighter and cheaper than lugging along a laptop computer. And so it might be handy if you want to start receiving 23 centimetre signals. Here in Melbourne, we're lucky that we've got a beacon. So a beacon offers a continuous signal that we can do receiving tests at any time of the day or night, even when no one is around. Sometimes you can get signals in the most unexpected places. First of all, I don't have line of sight at all to the beacon, so I'm relying it to bounce off the city, which is visible in the far distance. But I'm not even pointing to that. I'm just pointing to the corner of this building, and there's enough signal pickup for me to hear the beacon. So that's just a quick look at getting receiving capability on 23 centimeters. As for transmit, all I do there is I use a Kwangsheng UVK5 handheld transceiver and a frequency tripler that I modified. More in other videos. Enjoy these videos? Want to start in amateur radio? Well, check out my books, Ham Radio Get Started for USA readers and the Australian Ham Radio Handbook for those in Australia. For more information, visit my website vk3ye.com or search their titles on Amazon.